12.52, and we are back with more talk around town. It is flying by. only have around eight minutes left in our show today. Jeffrey Bowen, he has been my guest today. Um, he is a recording artist who has a CD. We just played his song earlier, earlier Bertha from Burksville. And he has a music video to go along with this song shot here in Cumberland County. Really, really neat video. Everybody in Cumberland County needs to see it. I know that you would enjoy it. So just recap the dates and let everyone know when that's going to be going on. On Saturday, May 5th, um, at 5.30 p.m., it starts down at the fairgrounds. And please, please correct me if I'm saying that wrong. It's down at the... The, um, pavilion the pavilion at yes. Veterans Park. At Veterans Park. And we will have a meet and greet. We're going to watch the Derby. And then we're going to have a, about a 30-minute concert. And then followed by watching the video for the first time. Okay. Uh, the, it will not be public until that point. Um, I want the people of Burksville, Kentucky to see it first. Um, awesome. And then... Um, uh, that's it. I'm so sorry. Oh, no, that's fine. Uh, hit so, the highlights. Okay. May the 5th. May the 5th. May the 5th. Mark that down. This is a music video that you want to see. It is just really neat to see. Um, you look at... I love Burksville, and you drive, I drive I drive through it every day, <laughs> and I think it is beautiful in some, you know, some <laughs> areas, but that video it just done a really, really good job, and it, seeing it in a different perspective, I guess, and it, it was really neat. Well, I've always like found that. this city charming. Um, so I, now, yeah. your town, where you are from, large city, small town, well, I'm originally from a very small town outside of Lafayette, Indiana. Okay. Um, I, I was born in one child in another and then raised in a little town of West Point, Indiana. It's in Tippecanoe County. I grew up, in fact, there's another track on the CD called When the Summer's Over, and it talks about creeks to swim in and trees to climb, and that's all about Flint Creek and being growing out, growing up in the cornfields and by creeks and, and camping and, and so on. I grew up out in the country, and gotcha. my grandparents that are from here, mm -hmm. the Bowens, were farmers their entire lives. They had land out in Warren County, which is to the east, and actually my brother Steve and his wife Wanda still uh, live in the house my grandparents had, and they do a produce stand on top of their 40-hour week job. And oh, okay. So uh, the predominant part of my life was spent in the country, gotcha. uh, but I've also lived in cities like Nashville, Tennessee. Right. I lived in Fort Lauderdale for a year. I live in Indianapolis, and I'm comfortable in both arenas. Mm -hmm. I, I feel I feel pretty good in in, in both situations. Right. Very different. Very. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, it's great to go to the other one, just particularly to go back out to the farm and back out to the country and just love to go camping, right. go camping all the time in the summer. And it's just good to be in that, to listen to birds, mm -hmm. and the sunshine Peaceful. on your face, and not hear interstate traffic and right. horns and sirens. Yes. Yes. <laughs> But, like you said, both, you can live in both. It's kind of what you get used to, I guess. Absolutely. Um, now, I don't know that I could live in the city. I guess I could if I had to. Yeah. <laughs> but I have just always lived here, and that's what I'm used to. Absolutely. So. And there is nothing wrong with here. I right. love it here, so I'm glad <laughs> yes, you're I do, here. I do, too. <laughs> now, this CD, is this your first CD you have released? Yes. Um, it, that's a lifelong project in the making. And okay. I, like I said, I did a lot of arranging for show choir through for many years and that was the fo my focus for a very long time and I kind of got the bug of performing again because I performed a lot in Decatur Illinois when I was through college mm -hmm. um, I was in summer programs for five summers and that's kind of where I honed my craft for public performance and I got away from it and then uh, years later started playing a piano bar in Owensboro, Kentucky, and I got that bug again. I was in my 40s. I felt like, you know, I'm going to be an arranger, and that's fine. I've been in music my whole life. I've been very blessed. But that performance bug started growing and growing, and by the time I got back to Indiana and Indianapolis, I've been in Indianapolis about four and a half years now, and it's and I am booking and booking and booking. So I've been playing things like in opera houses, and gotcha. um, I have my regular 
uh, things that I do every week right. in Indianapolis, and a couple of, and then farmers markets, and I've got I'm booked in Bloomington, Indiana later this year. Um, you should see about um, performing this maybe at one of our docks down here or something. That'd I would be cool. love to do that. I would, that would love be really to do cool. That. Absolutely. Yep, maybe maybe we should give you some contacts when we get off of the air because I think that would be really neat. That would be fantastic. And it would give you an excuse to come visit Burksville. I I need very little <laughs> excuse to come down to Burksville. I would spend much more time. I'm only four and a half hours away. It's not that far. It goes really quickly. <laughs> now, when did you actually release this CD? The CD was released in July of 2015. I'm sure um, it's a, a very long process getting everything. It was, well, and it was all, I'm uh, the, the sole producer, the sole everything. Right. Except, of obviously, the, the players yeah. on the CD. Um, I wrote the songs in 2012 mm -hmm. after I got back to the Lafayette area. Mm -hmm. uh, my dad had been diagnosed with cancer, and I actually moved back to help take care of him. Right. And through that, all of this, energy and, and creation kind of started coming out. Gotcha. And, so that's when it all started. The CD is reflective of, and it's called Frivolous, mm -hmm. which uh, it, it, if you listen to that song ever, and you can find that on YouTube, um, it, it's about me overworking, and I still overwork. I, I'm a workaholic and fully admit it, <laughs> but it's but it I've be been worse, loving I guess. <laughs> life and having such a great time. and and. But the whole CD is is about positive stuff. Um, the first song is, and you're going to hear that one at the video release. It's a song called "Hey Hey Louie," and there was this really cute llama that was a mile <laughs> and a half from my brother's house, and every, and I stayed with my brother when Dad was sick. And every time I drive by, I go "Hey Hey Louie" and just say it. <laughs> and one day I sang it, and I was like, "Uh oh." <laughs> That's uh -oh. funny. And so they'll hear "Hey Hey Louie" there at the at the uh, video release. But the whole, the whole CD, even the breakup song, um, has a positive spin at the end because I wanted this to be an uplifting, right. everything good type of deal. Well, I think everybody could definitely use some more positive, positive things in their life. Absolutely, <laughs> no doubt. We are actually out of time. I cannot believe it. It has flew by. Thank you so much. Well, Heather, we really thank, appreciate you coming over. Thank you for having me here today, and I really appreciate it. And thank you for the folks of uh, Burksville. Yes, no problem at all. Just a reminder, everyone in Cumberland County, you are invited to the um, reveal of this music video for Bertha from Burksville. May 5th starts at 530 down at Veterans Park there under the pavilion there will be live music just a fun day so if you can make it out to that if you have any questions just feel free to call us here at the radio station thank you all so much for tuning in to talk around town